Hey guys, this is Madman Mars 2000 with your WWE WrestleMania 24 predictions. Just to let you know, these are not spoilers in any way, shape, or form. These are just my strictly my predictions for the WrestleMania 24 card. My first prediction is for the triple threat match for the WWE Championship: the champion Randy Orton versus John Cena versus Triple H. My prediction is that Triple H is going to do exactly what he does best. He's going to abuse the power that he has backstage, and he will walk out the new WWE Champion, whether we all like it or not. My next prediction for the World Heavyweight Championship match, the Champion Edge versus The Undertaker. My prediction, The Undertaker's WrestleMania streak isn't going anywhere. It's getting bigger. It's getting better. My prediction is that The Undertaker will walk out the World Heavyweight Champion, and become 16-0 in WrestleMania. That streak is not going anywhere. My next prediction is for the Money in the Bank ladder match. Mr. Kennedy versus Shelton Benjamin versus Y2J versus Carlito versus MVP versus CM Punk versus John Morrison. I'm going on a landslide here, guys, and I'm going to predict Mr. Kennedy to win this match. And <clears throat> I know that's really going on a landslide because Mr. Kennedy's you know, he was Mr. Money in the Bank last year, and then he ended up getting injured, and then he ended up violating the wellness policy, and I know that WWE, they tried to give Jeff Hardy that second chance, and Jeff Hardy blew it, and WWE, they're probably worried that if they give Mr. Kennedy this chance, he'll do the very exact same thing, so I'm going on a major landslide here, and I'm going to go for Mr. Kennedy to win this match, even though I would prefer... Say Shelton, I would like Shelton Benjamin to win it myself. I think it's his time. But my next prediction is for Floyd Money Mayweather versus The Big Show. My prediction is The Big Show to win this match. And the way I see it, they're paying this Floyd Money Mayweather. They're paying him 20 mil for this appearance. The least the guy could do is lose to The Big Show. Come on, guys. And the way I see, you know, The Big Show, he's still going to be in the company long after Floyd Mayweather takes his 20 mil and hits the door. So. My prediction has to be with the Big Show, and I really hope the Big Show wins because this means the least Mayweather can do. The Brand Supremacy match, Batista versus Umaga. My prediction is Umaga to win this match, only because I know after WrestleMania, the WWE are supposed to give Umaga a major push. They're supposed to do another draft lottery, and from what I heard, Umaga is supposed to be drafted to SmackDown. He's supposed to end up feuding with The Undertaker for the World Heavyweight Championship, so... If they are giving Umaga this major push, I could see it starting tonight, or at uh, WrestleMania, excuse me. And I could see, I honestly think Umaga is winning this match. Ric Flair versus Shawn Michaels. My prediction is Shawn Michaels to win and end Ric Flair's career. I'm predicting this because this really is in real life Flair's last match. For those of you who know, when Ric Flair left the company a while back, he was gone for a few months. He actually wasn't even going to come back, but Ric Flair made the decision to come back so he can retire properly and have one last match at WrestleMania, and since this really is his retirement match, my prediction is Shawn Michaels to win. The Playboy Bunny Mania Lumberjack match, Maria and Ashley versus Beth Phoenix and Molina, my prediction is for Maria and Ashley to win this match, simply because this match is solely based on the Playboy cover girls. And it's just another way to promote Maria's Playboy, and since I, that's what I honestly believe, it's just another way to promote her Playboy, and Maria and Ashley will win this, and even my guess is that Maria's gonna end up getting the cover. And for those of you wondering why it's Maria and Ashley now instead of Maria and Candice, this is because Candice uh, re-injured her last injury, and she'll be out for a little while, so... Uh, the Belfast Brawl, Finley versus JBL. My prediction is Finley to win because I believe that Hornswoggle is going to make his return. He'll toss Finley a shillelagh, a shillelagh, he'll nail JBL with it, and that'll be it. Finley will win this match. The 24 man ECW Battle Royal to determine the number one contender to Chavo's ECW Championship. My prediction is Kofi Kingston to get the upset victory. And. That next is the ECW Championship match, my last prediction. I honestly think if it does turn out to be Chavo versus Kofi Kingston, my prediction is for Chavo to win this match simply because Kofi, you know, he just came into the company, he still has a lot to learn, he's 
just not ready to be a champion just yet, even though he's a great talent. I honest, I'm huge on Kofi. I, I think he could become major in the future, but I just don't think that the WWE is going to think that he's ready just yet. So I think that Chavo will indeed win this match. And those were my WrestleMania 24 predictions. I hope you guys enjoy WrestleMania this Sunday. And I'll see you next time, guys. I'm Madman Mars 2000.